Well, it's two things. We have this conception of a buyer's journey, you know, that starts with attention and interest and all those things that you generally see. But when you think about this, there is a, a person that you're dealing with that is on a buyer's journey. But that journey isn't the same journey that someone else might need to take. And that might not even be the right journey for the rest of their team. They might not be aware of the things that they need to be aware of to even be successful at that journey. So you have to start looking at it through a lens that says, what does this individual need? What do these individuals need? Because their journeys are all different. Some of them are more concerned about the change. Some are more excited by the change. Some have some experience that's useful. Some don't have enough experience to have an opinion, but they're in the room anyway. So you start, have to start looking at this and say, how do, I, how do I help these people get the ideas that they need to be able to successfully make a good decision and then produce the better results that they're after? When you think of it as everybody's doing it in the same linear way, like it's always linear, it always goes the same direction, that's just not true. And it's not true for the sales conversation either. I mean, the process that starts uh, target, qualify, discovery, solution development in a straight line from left to right, that's not been true for a decade. <laughs> and, and I used to um, just keep myself in the closet and not say it out loud, but I've been agnostic about that for so long just because I've seen as a salesperson that the, it just doesn't go in that order for them. They're, they're having much tougher time having the conversations than we think they are. And that's why many of them don't find their way to the end of the journey at all. They just drop out. And it's because there's too much politics, too much angst about change, concerns about whether or not it's going to work and if they're going to be chastised for making a poor decision. So there's all these things that are going on. You have to be aware and intuitive enough to recognize what those things are and to be one up enough to help people get through those things.